Hi everybody. Um, time to go over some more Fords in my collection. Um, like I said before, I'm primarily a Chevy collector. I collect almost anything at the Chevrolet and Hot Wheels 164. Um, however, some of the Ford castings are just really classics. And you can't go without having some in your collection. Um, the one thing about these castings, okay, uh, some of them is that they all have metal bases, okay? Um, I think this is, uh, casting is the uh, 3 Window 34, uh, which is a Ford. One, two, and then three. Oh, the tampo is there. Take a look at that later. Oh, it's the Hot Wheels symbol. Okay. Um, Metal base. Uh, this casting has been around since 1979, so it probably came out as a new model in 1980. Um, I think this one here is a Speed Gleamer series. Uh, this one's just a duplicate. Black metal base. what that is but this was a uh, part of a series car with the uh, small blade wheels this was the pinstripe series which was a nice series this I think came in a funny pack of Fords. Um, small wheels all the way around, and it's got the classic uh, shovel, not shovel, like classic uh, Hot Wheels Black Wolves. Uh, this is not a Z-Mac, this is just painted silver with some flames. Three spokes. Again, here's another one with the uh, Hot Wheels uh, Black Wolves. Uh, these are much bigger than the other ones, so you can kind of see a difference. Here's another one. Sort of like a teal gray, I guess it is, with flames, with the uh, five spokes. Here's another one, Chevrolet, not Chevrolet, hot, I can't remember why I keep saying Chevrolet, uh, 34, b and shifters, I can't see what the rest of that says. <clears throat> I think it might say Goodyear, I'm not sure. Um, with the classic Black Wolves, this was a Stars and Stripes series, um, red, white, and blue, very nice, I like this one, that's a good color combination. And last but not least in a 34 Ford, three windows. Um, or three window 34s. This was a premium model. It's got real rider tires and tampo on the tail lights. Okay. <clears throat> uh, two other Fords in here are. Oops, one more. I'm sorry, and this one. This one right here. Sorry, missed this. Now for the trucks. Um, this is the Baja Breaker, but this is obviously a Ford van. Um, the Ford vans have a longer snout, 
Okay, so it's in with my Ford collection. All right. I think this is the WWE. I'm sorry, folks, I forget what they're calling this one, but it's a Ford, okay, delivery, all right. And I believe this is a 34 Ford, and same front end. The fender's a little bit different, and the bumper's a little bit different. different casting but I'm not quite sure if it's the same year or not um, anyway convertible Ford okay uh, this was a series card too um, can't remember the name of it offhand okay this is a 40s Ford uh, convertible a nice casting it's really got some nice lines on it looks good in this color too really looks nice Ford truck uh, when this first came out it used to have a flip up and flip open hood uh, they since cast it shut so this is a later model It's a Ford panel delivery, I think that's what it's called. I can't remember offhand. Uh, in this light, this is a nice color. This is the Ford Ranchero. Ford's version of the El Camino. And this is a 72 Ranchero. Front end looks like a... Uh, the heck I can't remember front end looks like a Torino is what I wanted to say reminds me of the front end on the uh, Ford Torino okay but it's nice casting <clears throat> Ford Thunderbolt Teardrop hood. Race car. Ford Bronco from the Surf Surf Crate series or Surfing series that came out last year. I don't even remember if I have all of them from that series, but that's what this is from. Ford Fairlane GT, it's a 66. And this one you don't see too often, and it has an opening hood, which is kind of cool. 56 Merc. So I had to pick this one up. Just because you don't see it, so I have no idea what happened to this testing here. Okay. Uh, again, also a Ford, or based on a Ford, but doesn't say Ford, is the um, 40s Woody wagon. Okay, 
Yeah, this is a casting I do like to collect. I don't care if it's a Ford or not. It's still a great casting. Uh, two of these. You notice they have metal bases. Uh, this is not all inclusive. I know I have some in packages. Okay. Uh, let's see. This is uh, copyrighted 1979. This casting has been around since 1980. These next two right here are dupes, duplicates, okay. This one here is a metal base too. This was from the uh, KB Toy Store uh, police series that they were putting out with Rear Riders. El Segundo Police. Okay, and again, El Segundo is where Hot Wheels is located, their uh, corporate office for Mattel. Pinstripe series. That did. It's a B E K A K custom. Surf boat. Surf beat. Know what I'm looking at. Hot Wheels Wild Wave in the window. Tone. And here's another one with surfboards. It's kind of neat. I like it when they put this stuff on top. And this stuff does come off. Okay. Why lose it? So keep it on there. See, even the surfboards are different, which is kind of cool. This one right here is a tuned version, which I kind of thought was neat because they just came out with this one last year, and it does have a surfboard. Okay, but it's not removable, it's molded in there. Uh, here's the new Ford 2016 Ford GT Racer, copyright 2016, so it came out in 2017. Let's see if we've got a plastic wing. So if you're into the Ford GT, there you go. That's a uh, new model. And then some uh, off. Um, that's it for the Fords for this case. Now I have some. Uh, um, additional cars in here which weren't uh, didn't have room for in other cases so I have a Risto Rat the first edition or a new model it's kind of cool this is supposed to tilt up so you can run it on track but it, it doesn't stay so Hot Wheels I wish that would work on this mm. uh, Hot Wheels 500 I think this is based on like sort of an Indy or F1 car. Here's a quad rod. I think this was a new model. Okay. Baja hauler. El Viento. Huh. That comes off. Okay, so this is a track car. 
this is cool. Head starter. Yeah, I wonder why. Okay. And Flintstones mobile. Got the wheels up here that run. And shark bite. I think this is what it's called. So when the wheels move. right here that causes it to run and it's also on the other other side if you can see that tab right there all right that's it for this case um hope you enjoyed it i uh, hope you subscribe uh if you have any comments questions uh please leave it below and uh, please check out my other videos and uh, i hope you all have a good day